I have two little girls, Olivia and Elizabeth, who are about 15, 16 months apart. Chose to keep both of our girls in St. Mark's um, for all of their preschool experience. Uh, we grew to feel that St. Mark's and its members were more like family. Always felt secure that our children were safe and that their needs were met first, which was very important. Um, that if ever we needed any support in any manner, that it was there for us. Um, and in fact, it came down to that when I, as you know, I developed breast cancer. And it was a very tough, very scary time for my whole family, kids, kids especially. And uh, everyone at St. Mark's, not only in the preschool, but members of the church, the community here, had gotten to know my children and had known me from dropping them off. And the outpouring of support that we got, the outreach from the folks at St. Mark's to us, might, might get a tear here and start to cry, it meant everything. It truly meant everything to us. And it ended up being one of the most positive experiences in my life. It sounds crazy to say that about cancer, but just knowing that I had so many people praying for me and offering to help us, bringing meals to us, just from preschool, you know? Um, the whole church really extended itself to us. And we'll never forget that. We'll always be very grateful. Yeah. And How were the girls prepared for kindergarten when they got to kindergarten? What was, you know, the experience? I will say that both of my girls have placed in the upper percentile of their classes. They knew all of their colors, their numbers, um, they had a good understanding of phonics. Um, they were more advanced than a lot of children in their class. Um, at the same time, another thing that I really appreciated about St. Mark's, the Christian values was certainly very important to us. Um, loving each other, respecting each other. I have nothing cool. but good things to say about St. Mark's and its members. And the preschool especially. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways, all right. Thank you. Yeah, thanks.